Hello chess lovers, I have a very short and beautiful game for you played by a German chess master Richard Teichmann. Unfortunately the name of his opponent is unknown. White started with e4 and e5 by Teichmann, f4, white goes for king's gambit and d5. This is the folk beer counter gambit, e takes d5, e4, knight c3, knight f6, queen e2, bishop d6, d3, black castles, d takes e4 and here comes this knight sacrifice on e4, knight takes e4, rook e8, pinning the knight, and king d1. White king is escaping from this dangerous e-file, bishop f5, putting more pressure on e4 knight, and understanding that he is losing the knight, white decides to play knight f6 check at least to double black's pawns and weaken king's side. g takes f6 and a bad move by white, queen h5. A better move was queen d2, preventing bishop b4 and protecting the pawn on d5. But after queen h5, here comes bishop b4, threatening checkmate on e1 and at the same time attacking the pawn on d5. Knight f3 covering the e1 square and here comes this queen takes d5 check. Bishop d3 and in this position Teichmann made an astounding move. Can you find his next move? Ready? He just captured on d3 with the bishop. You can see that right now the queen is hanging. He is just going for a queen sacrifice. Queen takes d5. Uh, by the way. If queen g4 check with the idea of capturing on d3 after king h8, black can simply cover the king and give a discovered check. But after queen takes d5, we see this amazing bishop e2 checkmate in the game. What a beautiful game by Richard Teichmann. Your comments and questions please. And thanks for watching. Good luck.